hi guys today we will be replacing one of the gears of my vivita aeroview video drone as you can see this one just turns around while the others are pretty steady so we have to change it um, it's a very simple process you start off by taking off the prop or the propeller it's a very simple process I have a video on that so for those who don't know how to take it off they can watch that video it is a very basic and simple process it just turns around and it kind of jerks up and down which is very strange it's not supposed to do that so i guess when i had the crash it uh it pretty much caused some damage so let's get in there and see um uh, what we have to do but i hope my guess is that it's just the gear that needs to be changed so uh let's dive in one of the funny thing about this is you have to remove all the four protections um, that covers the the motor itself and then after that you can get in it is strange there I would have thought that they would make it in such a way that if one gear has a problem you can just deal with that one side as opposed to taking off taking the whole thing apart but it is what it is so yep yeah, see those two are out but you have to take the rest out too Yep, and this is the last one. Okay, we're almost there. And then it has five screws underneath that we have to take out. So we take out all of them. And then we can go in and remove the gear that needs to be replaced this is my favorite drone amongst all my drones and I can't wait to get it back flying so <laughs> yeah uh, one two three four more Okay, let's see. Now we take it apart. You have to be careful not to snap anything underneath. So the best thing is just lift it up some few inches and then just turn it around like this. Normally this right here should should be attached to the motor. So just the fact that it is not attached that's that presents a problem also. So I would have to screw it back in. And as you can see this is pretty worn out my goodness <laughs> yep all the teeth is gone so i got this online and yep i'm gonna use about four of them online and they look pretty much the same even though this has that that little metal uh covering over there but it's pretty much the same thing Please don't forget to, to screw this piece back on the uh, motor itself and then assemble everything. Now it's just a reverse of what we did earlier. And we have to make sure that everything is inside. Yeah, that's one of the disadvantages of having to take everything apart as opposed to 
just dealing with one side because if the pieces were in such a way that you could deal only with the affected area without taking everything apart it will be uh, much more reasonable in my opinion anyway so be careful to replace every screw because if if you miss anyone then it makes it unstable so it's a game of patience and just being careful i can't wait to get this drone back flying i've missed it all this while and <laughs> Yeah, I was thinking of maybe just to go get a new one, but I was advised to just order the gears and then replace it. Um, it's more cost effective and hopefully it works. Yep, so it's just to assemble everything. It looks like I didn't take this out completely. So if you realize that it's a it's moving a little bit faster it's because I have added the speed to the video so I am not that fast <laughs> oh so basically guys from here it's just the opposite of what we did earlier just um, mount everything back in place just be careful to make sure that you do not miss any screw or misplace any screw um, everything should be normal and once everything is assembled properly and if that was the only problem the drone hard then it should work normally so i just can't wait like i said i just can't wait to fly this drone i just love it i love the way it it flies okay guys everything is been assembled and as you can see the lights are on let's do a test run here to see if everything is turning oh yeah that's what I'm talking about uh-huh yeah <laughs> yeah look at this oh I can't wait it's raining outside, but it looks like I'm not going to wait. <laughs> yeah, everything looks okay. And guys, thank you for watching. Please subscribe, leave your comments below. And um, I can't wait to do it, uh, a flight test on these and see what it does. And um, thank you. Thank you. Subscribe and see you on my next video. Bye-bye for now.